Candace Taylor is a Republican candidate for governor in Georgia. And you wanna watch this whole video because it is shocking how dumb this woman is, just shocking. So she fell for a parody video making fun of her and her views. She has a three word slogan as part of her campaign. It's Jesus guns babies. That's it, Jesus guns babies, great. She included this in a lot of her branding and advertising. In fact, there's a campaign bus that she's standing in front of. Jesus guns babies. That's like the <laughs> okay. second weirdest part about that billboard. Let's uh, let's take a look at it again. What's what's the first weird part about what you, it? What do you think it is? Hold on, let's, let's put it let's, up. Let's take a look. I'm the one you've been Why waiting for. Why is the for? one in red? Like, is that is that like a religious thing or is that you like a Q thing? Why is the one different? I'm the one you've been waiting for. You could just say that. When you make one bolded, it's like. I don't, it, this is like, I don't, is this a reference to like an 8chan conspiracy theory? I don't even know. But it's, it's a funny. weird thing to put emphasis on. I think it's fine. That didn't bother me. I don't I, like it. I think the the slogan, like Jesus, okay, you're right winger, sure. cool, Jesus, fine. Sure. Guns, babies. Mm hmm. <laughs> it's like they have the contradictions in their campaign, like in every slogan and every campaign that they put out there. It's like, yeah, we're, they're just giant contradictions. But anyway, yeah, I don't even like. It's like, like like raise the minimum wage or stop global babies. Yeah, like what what about them? You want to make them healthier? You want to see how many you can pile before they topple? What what about the babies specifically? Do you want to do? What about the babies? Well, think about the babies. <laughs> just everything about babies. Just do whatever you want, babies. It's so weirdly vague. Somebody was hired to paint the side of that thing, and they're like, "This doesn't make any sense." But whatever, I'm getting paid. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. We haven't even scratched the surface, guys. That's how amazing the story is. Okay, so apparently uh, someone was dunking on her and uh, it was parody. But this uh, woman, Candace Taylor, didn't realize it was parody. So comedian Blair um, Erskine imperson impersonated Taylor in a mocking video, uh, which the candidate actually thought was uh, legitimate praise and an endorsement. So before we show you the ad that Taylor posted to Twitter, which you do not want to miss, mm -hmm. here is the original parody video that the candidate thought was was real and genuine. I'm filled with the love of Christ and bang energy drink, and I'm ready to bang Georgia. And guess what? If you get pregnant, you're keeping it because when I'm governor, all abortion will be illegal because that fetus could be a Jesus. I will get rid of every communist through a little game I like to call Duck Duck Communist. It's just like Duck Duck Goose, but the goose is a communist. I believe in three things, Jesus, guns, and babies. Jesus because he founded America. Guns because we need them to protect ourselves from the government, which I'm currently trying to be a part of. And babies because the baby. So vote for me because that fetus could be a Jesus. That's amazing. That was so, that good. so good. Yeah, no, her work is always amazing. That um, was amazing. Yeah. So um, I don't know. I just don't think it takes much to realize that that was not genuine. That yeah. it was parody. But no, Candace Taylor was like, she loves me. I nailed it. Mm -hmm. And so uh, she puts this out on Twitter. When I'm elected as governor of Georgia, I will invite Blair to sit with me and talk about all the issues the corrupt establishment has left behind. What, what, left the, behind where? Yeah, I don't. Like the incumbent that you beat, maybe? Is that what you mean? I don't even understand. It, it, isn't it your favorite when Republican candidates pretend like they're anti establishment and they're really looking out for the little guy? Because that's really what the GOP has represented, right? Yeah, it's. Uh, look, I will grant. A very small percent chance that what is happening is not that this candidate doesn't get that Blair Erskine is a comedian or whatever, but that she's then trolling us in response. I what if it's jujitsu? She, a woman whose campaign slogan is "Jesus guns babies," is not sophisticated well, enough to do this like. 3D trolling exercise that okay. you're talking about. Okay, fake news media. <laughs> her her campaign slogan is not Jesus guns baby. That is her detailed policy platform. 
Oh, okay, campaign then. slogan is I'm the one you've been waiting for. <laughs> Let's keep it real, okay? So if you thought that maybe, you know, that tweet doesn't indicate that she fell for the parody, we've got more. Here's another tweet. Blair is right, all abortion is murder and will be criminalized in Georgia. Jesus. She's also right that America's founding was through divine intervention. <laughs> Jesus is with our movement and we will take Georgia back from the corrupt swamp and return it to the people. Okay. I mean, Jesus was the one adjudicating during, you know, mm -hmm. the American Revolution. So is like that, that your Okay, is that again her not getting that Blair is a comedian or is that cover? Is that like Oh no, look what I've done. I've been out it is not getting it. Well, here I'm going to make it seem as if she was secretly making good points. I no, think that's no. what she was doing. No, I think you're wrong. Am I I'm just giving her more credit. Let me give you more. I yeah, why, cool why are you, yeah, why? Look why? Why are you giving her the benefit of the What's wrong I've with you? I've been waiting for one that is she. <laughs> I've been waiting for a girl like you. <laughs> okay, let's get to the next tweet. She also writes, I want to thank Blair for her continued promotion of our wonderful no. movement. God mm. bless you. But no, it's it cover. It's cover. She's trying to like either make herself a part of the joke now. Mm -hmm. That's all it is. And somewhere, Marjorie Green is watching this and just thinking, dumbass. <laughs> Even she doesn't have any respect for this anymore. There's more. No. There's God. more. I, I thought, thought the, you were familiar with this. I thought the billboard woman. was the whole thing. How busy no. is she? Someone no. take her phone, please. She then put out a campaign ad that includes Blair in the compilation. I'm not kidding. Okay, let's see this. Let's watch. The governor's race in Georgia has four establishment politicians. And then there's Candace Taylor. I'm one of ye. I'm filled with the love of Christ because when I'm governor, all abortion will be illegal. I believe in three things, Jesus, guns, and babies. Jesus because he founded America. Guns because we need them to protect ourselves from the government, so vote for me. Candace Taylor, the one we've been waiting for. What was she looking at in that video? What was going, like, was she being followed by a squirrel? What was she so scared <laughs> yeah, of? I don't know. By the way, if you did get spooked by wildlife, do another take. This isn't like like big reams of film, it's digital. You can just press delete and then record it again. No. I think her I think she's genius. I think the whole she's campaign might be a joke honestly at this point. No. It's too much. I no mean, one would do all of this. How do you find a way to out crazy members of the current Republican Party to a point where people would actually want to talk. Like we're talking about her. So that now, true. now I'm starting mm. to think Ooh, maybe wait, maybe no. this is part of a, a, a bigger strategy. No, but then it, there's another layer. All of this was presented to Blair Erskine as a PR thing to get her into the news again. They ran a fake candidate, whap, maybe. <laughs> After she put out that ad that mm -hmm. includes the comedian making fun of her, uh, there's more. Uh, well, it, Blair actually responded to it because she's like, oh, <laughs> she thinks that I'm actually a supporter. Mm -hmm. And so she uh, quote tweeted Candace Taylor, <laughs> y'all, I, and then later had to clarify, like, I'm not supportive of you, bro. Like, what's wrong with you? Yeah. Our video reached 1 million views, Candace Taylor wrote on Twitter. Our government is rotten to the core and a Band-Aid won't fix it. It needs surgery, Jesus, guns, and babies. That's not how you spell Band-Aid. There's just a lot going on there here. There is, John, um, there is. Coming out of it, I do have a request though. Uh, this is directly to Blair Erskine. Have you considered just running for Congress as a Republican? You could totally fool all of them. Get in there and then just do whatever you want for two years. There's nothing they can do once you get in there. Take a look at Kirsten Cinema. She's proven that. Yeah. Blair Erskine, run for Congress, please. I mean, yeah. Every one of her videos, somebody falls for it. They don't get it. That that is how good she is. Her performance is excellent. It is it, excellent. Yeah, it is hilarious. Really Very good. Well and honestly, the Republican candidates have been more and more unhinged throughout the years that I've worked here. Mm -hmm. So 
I could totally see people watching parody videos like that, thinking like, yeah, yeah, it's a real, that's a real Republican candidate. That's how pathetic our state of politics has become. Thanks for watching The Young Turks. Really appreciate it. Another way to show support is through YouTube memberships. You'll get to interact with us more. There's live chat emojis, badges. You've got emojis of me, Anna, John, JR. So those are super fun. But you also get playback of our exclusive member only shows and specials right after they air. So all that, all you gotta do is click that join button right underneath the video. Thank you.